Hello guys, welcome to another video. Today, um, as you see, it's um the desktop, and you're like, what? But really, I'm making a video on how to make a modded server on 1.6 because there's some really good mods on 1.6, and you might want to play with your friends. Some of them are not compatible. I don't know why. Don't ask me. It's the mod creator code or something like that. But um, yeah. So first thing you want is to make a folder. New folder and just call it mod server. Well you can call it whatever you want actually. And yeah, you don't have to put anything in. Now go into your internet browser. This will be in the description. Um so yeah. Download for latest, but I've got the um one eleven point whatever. 11.1.965 1 1 whatever yeah I'm pretty much behind wait no no I've got the latest you've got the latest um so yeah download the installer and when you have it here then it'll pop up here all you want to do is double click on it and then install server don't click OK because that just won't even work. So now you browse into your areas. So I go onto my desktop, then mod server, don't click on it, just go like this and open. And now OK. It's gonna do some loading here, so I'll be back when it has loaded. Alright guys, um this is what it's gonna say when it's complete. Complete. Successfully downloaded Minecraft server. Downloaded six libraries and installed Forge. If it says less libraries, it's still okay. It should be okay anyway. If it doesn't work, I don't know why. Maybe download the Forge again or redo this process. All right. Click OK. Now, as you see, the stuff. That's good. Don't click this one because that user's gonna break the server. Click the universal. And now I had problems with this before. I don't know how I fixed it. That for some reason it didn't load up for me. But yeah, it should start making a new world. And 60, 72, 83, 93. Okay, done. Then just click stop. Oh, not click stop. Right, stop. In the little thingy. And just wait. Don't click the X ever because. You're gonna break this server. So now it's just gonna save some stuff. Well, it might not break it, but sometimes it breaks. Right, you've done. Now you got a world. You can always change it. Change it some other world. Okay. No ops. I probably wanna op myself. There we go. Save. And now. You always click the universal, as I said. Server properties, I don't know what you want. Test server. There you go. That's mine. And then you can, like, change all the stuff here. So now you've got mods. And I'm just seeing parachute mod, but you can use any mod if it's working. If it doesn't work, just use a different mod. But yeah, um, I'm sure parachute works because it worked. If it does, I'm just going to do a different mod. Put it in, obviously. So yeah, I'm ready, and I'll just load up the server. Got my forge here. I should keep in there. Okay, it's starting. Now I'm gonna load up my Minecraft whilst that's starting. Minecraft. So yeah, now I gotta wait a bit. Oh, and before I do that, actually, as this is Windows 8, in Windows 7 you go on your icon here and then write something in. Oh god. Go ahead. You need to go on percent, app, data, percent. Then go on your Minecraft. Mine's at the bottom, I don't know why. Mod, and you only want the parachute mod. So take all these out. I'm going to put them back in. Probably. I don't know. I'm gonna put them somewhere so you, can model, so you don't get muddled up with all the other files. All right, only parachute now. I can load it up. 
because with if you don't have the mod and the server has the mod, it doesn't let you in. So I can't test it with a different player because I just can't. I can't just get other players right now on. So remember to change into Forge here. Oh, by the way, you got to install Forge on your computer to actually use the server. If you want me to do a video about that, put it in the description, one comment, and I'll still uh, do the video so I can help you guys. But it's fairly simple. It's like takes like two minutes on them, probably less, but maybe loading. I don't know. Depends how your computer is. Mine's not. Well, mine's um not so fast, but not like really slow. Okay, as you see, parachute mod. Yeah. Right, multiplayer. I've got a lot of servers here. Here, that's mine. Test server. Oh, and you have to port forward as well, which I showed in my in like a really old video how to port forward. So I'll show. I think I did. But it's different for every uh, router, so I can't really help you guys. Um. See, so yeah, I just search up how to. Um. Put forward and then on your router, whatever your name of the router is, it's join server. You want to join? Right, it's loading. I am. Um, now, if I go on a uh, game mode, see, I can show you better. Don't know, I don't know. There it is, parachute. So, as you see, that worked. And so, you can see what the parachute is. Um, some some of like flans mods don't work really well. All right, parachute. Oh, what fail? I'm gonna go really high and then drop. Yeah, hell yeah. Uh, parachute and a shift to fall. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, well, hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in another one. Tell me in the comments if you need help with this. Like any help and I'll try to solve the mystery and if you want me to make a video on how to um, thingy, install forge on your computer then I'll help I'll do it yeah I can't get my words out today for some reason so you guys I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time Bye.